All right, guys, the million dollar question, the, the one everybody's constantly um, want, uh, wants to pick my brain uh, about uh, my tattoos, especially my facial tattoos, and, um, and why I got um, um, why I got something related to a culture or looking like a culture that I don't represent. Doesn't really matter. Are you so narrow-minded that you really have to ask, ask that question? Um, I can't see the, you know, I, I don't see the problem in it. People do what they want to do every day and I'm just another guy doing what I love and and that's part of that being getting my my face tattooed. Uh, and I always I always had great respect for the the old cultures, the Egyptians, the the Chinese, and um, the the all the old island cultures, the the old people, the old cultures. And um, when I was nine years old, I saw a movie uh, about uh, Maori people from New Zealand, the Maori guys, and um, I just fell in love with the with the moko. And um, when I had the chance, I started doing doing uh, facial tattoos, and um, it just it just went on from there. When I had the chance, I just started doing the facial tattoos, and I didn't have the I didn't have the the clear sight at that point to do a full moko at at, uh, at that point. So I started out in the I started out with something else, but I turned it around and I um, I finished it off with with a full facial tattoo. And that's what um, that's a little bit about that story whereby where my facial tattoos originate from inspiration from other cultures than my own yes that's that's a fact and um, why I why I chose to do it why I choose to do it I don't know why I just felt like it I just followed my heart and that was what, uh, what I wanted to do and that was what it, that is what feels and felt right at that point and also feels right today I'm self-employed I got my own business I got a wonderful girlfriend I got what I want I can always expand but trust me I don't miss out on anything and I'm fucking proud of it. And I never, ever, ever, ever regret anything, especially not my facial tattoos. I hope that covers something. I hope that covers some of your curiosity about my, my ink and my, my mask. It's not because I want to hide my personality, I, because I want to hide my face, or whatever you may assume you know about me. This has nothing to do with me covering a personality behind a raw image. It has something to do with a, a past that led up to this moment where I chose to make it a full facial tattoo and erase some of my past tattoos I got related to um, a rough time in my life where, I, where violence and 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 all the stuff was everyday life. So um, this is me. This is me as you see me, and this is who I am. This is not a mask. This is not a, a, a what's it called, camouflage to hide the one the, the the person inside. This is me telling you before you even hear my voice. This is me, not to scare you, just to lay it out there. Simple, easy and no filters. I have nothing to hide. Um, so if you're in doubt, don't take assumptions. Don't, don't assume you know anything about anybody until you really know them, until you really hurt them from the, hurt their own story. People, people do stuff. I see stuff that Makes me wonder sometimes, yeah. Sure, 
a lot of times. But do I assume? Uh, do I take uh, assumptions? Do I assume that I know what the fuck's going on inside the herd? No. Do I think about it? Yeah. But do I know anything about it? Nothing. I don't know anything. I sometimes I don't even know where the fuck I'm going in my own life. You know, I just work hard, do what I love, and follow my heart. And yeah, that's it, man. Um, hope this will this will help your curiosity out. That's all for me for now. Peace.